Want to take a trip where the whole family can have a great time? Watch to the end to learn about a great place for the whole family. Hey everyone, welcome back to Chow Pro. If this is your first time watching one of our videos, welcome to the family. I'm Emma and I work here at Trout Pro. Make sure you subscribe to our channel so you can keep up with all the latest things we're doing here at Trout Pro. Don't forget to like and share this video. If you want to be alerted every time we upload new content, make sure to hit the bell icon. If you ever have any questions, ask them in the comments below. Today, I'm going to be telling you about a great place in the mountains for you to take your family. By now, you're probably wondering what is the name of this town? So here you go, ready? It is Valley Cruces, North Carolina. It's located near Boone, North Carolina in the Blue Ridge Mountains, and it's so pretty and peaceful. Not everything on my list is exactly in Valley Cruces, but everything is either in or near Valley Cruces. It's a small town, but that doesn't mean there aren't plenty of things to do. Some of the things you can do in Valley Cruces are fish, hike, play, and shop. Let's first talk about fishing. There are many different places to fish in Valley Cruces. You can fish the Watauga River, Dutch, Clark, Laurel, or Crab Orchard Creeks, among others. Last time we were in Valley Cruces, some of us fished the Watauga River and the Crab Orchard Creek. The Watauga River is easily accessible through the Valley Cruces Community Park. It is a great spot for young kids to go fishing and wade in the river. The Crab Orchard Creek boasts a steep climb that is rewarded with a beautiful waterfall. When we went, my brother kept getting bites, but unfortunately did not catch anything. The Crab Orchard Creek is a great hike if you are looking for something short. Just keep in mind that it is steep. Next up, we have hiking. There are many different trails you can hike that are around or in Valley Cruces. Crab Orchard Falls is short but steep, while Price Lake is very easy. Moon Fork Trail has parts where it is easy and hard, while the Valley Cruces Community Park is like taking a walk along a greenway. The trails around the lakes at Moses Cone are easy. Moving on to play, there are several fun things to do in Valley Cruces. Three of these you can find at Harvest Farm, and they are a corn maze, a hayride, and a pumpkin patch. The corn maze is fun, but pretty difficult. I will link Harvest Farm in the description box below if you want to check it out. Valley Cruces Community Park is a great park featuring a playground, basketball goal, a soccer field, playhouses, sculptures, a place to wade in the water, and more. It's a great place to have a picnic, and yes, it does have indoor restrooms. Last but not least, we have shopping. There are several cute shops located in Valley Cruces. The original Masked General Store is there along with the Masked General Store Annex. At the Annex, there is a park called the Candy Barrel and, like the name suggests, boasts many barrels full of different types of candy. It's any kid's dream. Across the street from the Annex is the Lavender House. The original Masked General has several different shops around it that you might like to stop in, such as River Cross. That's all I have for now. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, let us know by subscribing to our channel and liking this video. Follow us on Facebook and Twitter for all the latest news or subscribe to our email list, which I will link in the description box below. Make sure to hit the bell icon to be alerted when we upload our next video. Don't forget to keep a lookout for it. Bye!